black conservative group crushes Al Gore, he made a living peddling lies, the National Leadership Network of Black Conservatives Project 21 attacked Al Gore for trying to increase the price of carbon as a part of his global warming alarmism. Isn't it cute when someone who has made a living peddling lies about the weather lectures Americans about how they should live? Actually, it isn't. It's not cute, it doesn't make sense, and it's downright insulting, said co-chairman Stacey Washington. Americans have every right to use all the energy they can afford, just like Al Gore does in a mansion you might be able to see from space at night because of its size and energy use. Gore simply doesn't practice what he preaches. His electricity use rivals over 21 American households combined. We should ignore his climate decrees until he starts walking the walk, said Washington. Al Gore's comments and actions hammer home the fact that climate change alarmists aren't taking into account how much their pet project hurts African Americans, other minorities and low-income families, said Derek Colley, another member of Project 21. Energy is the lifeblood of our society. Any increase in its cost disproportionately affects lower-income groups. Green activists tend to ignore how their agenda affects energy poverty, which keeps disadvantaged populations poor through high energy prices and decreased economic opportunities. Only the wealthy can afford things like solar panels. Al Gore recently tried comparing the fight against climate change to the civil rights movement. Does he need to give it up? Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my STC News channel. Goodbye and see you again.